Pearl Jam on 92.3 WTTS. Matt Pelser with you Friday. Carb Day out at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. And I think it's high time we talk to a rookie. Joining me from Ed Carpenter's team, Christian Rasmussen. Hello. Hello. How's it going? Excellent. So as a rookie to this race uh, and to race for a hometown favorite like Ed Carpenter, obviously you know the significance of this race to the city and his family. Um, I know it's hard to put a feeling like that into words, but how has the sum of all that made you feel as you look at your first Indy 500 start? Yeah, first of all, it's been amazing being part of uh, Ed Carpenter Racing. Um, They have huge support and a great track record around the around the speedway, um, so it's been a great being a part of that, but um, yeah, I've uh, taken to the oval pretty well, it's definitely been a learning experience, um, getting up to speed on, uh, yeah, doing over 230 miles an hour, um, that's pretty <laughs> intense, but uh, no, I think I've taken to it pretty good, I think we have good cars, and I think we have uh, a good chance to move forward in the race. Christian Rasmussen, I talked to your boss uh, earlier this week, Ed Carpenter, and he had good things to say about how it's going for you, especially on Monday when you left both Ed and Renus, both teammates, in the dust. Uh, how did that feel to show them up at practice? Yeah, it feels good. I mean, it's hard to read too much into all those practice times with uh, with all the huge drafts that everyone get, gets. Um, but overall, I feel like we're doing a good job of uh, of handling all the traffic, which is kind of the name of the game um, at the Indy 500. So every time I hit the track, I learn something new, and I'll keep doing that through the race as well to, to get better and be there at the end. So my favorite thing, Christian, is when a big thing that I've been anxious about is over. Like whether or not it goes well, it's always a nice weight lifted once it's done, and I like to celebrate – Obviously, if you win, the celebration will be huge, but say you just perform well for your first Indy 500 and Ed's happy with how you did. How might you celebrate on Sunday night? Yeah, we'll see. I have uh, I have a lot of family in town, which is, is going to be awesome. But just to kind of add to your point about that weight lifted off your shoulders, because the Indy 500, especially as a rookie, there definitely is a lot of you know, nerves and, and stuff coming into it. And I think especially qualifying day is, is super intense. But I did really feel that once that first run on qualifying day was over, I really did feel that huge weight lifted off my shoulders. And you feel, yeah, you know, 5,000 pounds lighter than <laughs> the rest of the day once that, that first run is out of the day. But, um, yeah, we'll see. I'll take it one day at a time. Hopefully we'll have a great race on Sunday, and I'll be able to celebrate with my family that day on Sunday. Indeed. Christian Rasmussen will race his very first Indy 500 on Sunday, driving for Ed Carpenter Racing and starting on the outside of row eight. Christian, thanks for your time. We'll be watching. Perfect. Thank you.